Alright, going back to like uh, 2015 and what is up guys, Nailer27 here and welcome back to another video. So uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited to be filming this right now because we're doing another unboxing video as the title says and it's a really good one. So let's head over to the unboxing room which is my bedroom. Okay, so there's let's been a slight change of plans on where I'm recording this because the lighting in my room is just awful. Like the natural light isn't complimentary to anyone at all, especially me since I'm the one recording it. And um, the light is like dead center in the room. So like it, it just gets in the way of everything. So I brought us in my old stomping grounds, the TV room where I will be unboxing my new Air 58 Final Mouse Ninja Edition. Now, I, I've already gotten the tape off of the box that it shipped in because who wants to sit here for like 20 minutes and watch me do that? And so, there's a paper that goes with it. It's just the shipping stuff. It's, it doesn't even matter. This doesn't matter. So, um, here we have the actual box with the mouse inside, if you guys can see that. There we go, perfect. Um, dude, this thing is so expensive. It's crazy, it was like $200 on Amazon, but I got it cheaper. It was like 220 on Amazon, but I got it cheaper on eBay. And I am just so psyched because I do have a PC now. If you guys want, you can come check out my stream at um, Ice Nitro, Th actually, it's just Nitro now, I believe. It's just Nitro now. Oh, wow. So supposedly, this is the lightest mouse in the world. Forget the exact weight. There's the cord for it. And there she is. The Ninja Air 58 mouse. Absolutely incredible. This thing, it's just insane, dude. Like, my god. Comes with something on the box. I think this is some more Final Mouse thing. Designed to be completely driverless, you can simply plug in, plug and play in any PC gaming slash eSport environment. Uh, pressing the button underneath the mouse wheel will cycle the DPI between intervals of 400, 800, 1600, and 3200. For any support you may require, please contact our support email de department directly. The email below support at finalmouse.com. So, this is gonna be a bit of a challenge for me because the mouse that I'm currently using is a uh, Cyber Power mouse and um, it comes with a lot more DPI accessibility. Like, um, the DPI that it comes with is 200, 400, 800, 1200, 1600, and then 3200. So, I usually rock 1200 DPI, but this one only has um, 800 DPI and 1600 DPI. So what I'll have to do is probably bump the sensitivity up in game, try and feel that out. But um, besides that, I'm very happy with this mouse because it it's just beautiful. It's gorgeous and it's the lightest mouse. Oh my god, that thing is literally it, it's weightless, dude. It it has no weight. That that's just insane. One more look without the plastic on. It's gorgeous. I'm just, I'm so happy with this. It's beautiful. And it has two customizable buttons on the side. Very sensitive, and I like that. But, um, the scroll wheel has a bunch of ninja marks. I don't even know what it says, but whatever it says, it's going to be glorious. No matter what. Oh, well, there's a little curve to that. It's just so light and so just great. So I'm going to take you guys to my room now where the gaming setup is and just give you guys a little tour of that because I haven't shown that officially on my YouTube channel yet. So why don't we go and do that? So this basically is the room where it happens. If you guys know Hamilton, you know that reference very well. I'm just going to set you down right there. I'm going to be very careful. So this is the mouse I'm rocking right now. Um, they're around the same size, but um, this one, I just love the colors on the Air 58. This one does glow, so if like I turn on my PC, which is a Cyber Power, highly recommended. They build very high quality PCs. It's a pre-built. Um, once this thing gets a little older, I will have to upgrade it in the future, but that won't be too hard. See, um, this mouse, I also have a Corsair K55 keyboard, and my monitor is a VG245H gaming monitor by Asus. 
Um, this is my old uh, Cyber Power keyboard that came with the PC. But um, if you see here, red is 200 DPI, yellow 400, green 800, blue 1200, purple is 1600, and pink is 3200. So it has a lot more DPI custom customizability, but the final mouse is definitely going to be superior in terms of just like accuracy and just the weight of the mouse overall. But um, yeah, I'm just super excited to plug this thing in and see how it works. So let's do that real fast. So if you guys just want to come down below and take a look at with me for a second, in the back of the PC, um, basically, there are multiple places where I can plug in the mouse, multiple USB ports, but I'm only going to be, I'm going to take out the mouse that I have now, um, because I don't need the other one because I don't have a dual PC setup, I don't have a dual monitor setup, so I don't need the extra mouse for anything else, so I'm probably just going to bring that, school and use that for my Chromebook and just flex on those people, so, uh, yeah, that's probably what I'll end up doing with the mouse, but just letting you guys know. By the way, how do you like my background? Remember Six Siege? I, I, I found it very nice. So the mouse now is all hooked up. We are all ready to go. And one thing that I forgot to mention is also not just how light the mouse is itself, but how light these cords are. Like these cords for this one, although thinner, are much heavier than this one. So it's going to put a lot less drag on me when I'm actually gaming. The mouse feels pretty good so far. So I'm going to type in my password. Do, do, do. All right, and there we go. We're in. It it feels uh, it feels great. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I got for the video. One last thing: if you guys see this video, feel 100% free to join our server, the Fug Boy server. I along with um, our friends Eli and Isaac. Isaac, explain Minecraft, wow. Um, we're running this server, and so far, we've got me6 the bot, and a few other members, giving them a shout out. We have a bunch of different roles, things that you can do, just a place for our community to interact. We got memes, obviously. So um, yeah, definitely recommend joining the server, but that's pretty much it for this unboxing video and testing video. You know, just the mouse, it feels great, and I'm very happy with it. So, um, yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, please don't be afraid to leave a like. It's very much appreciated. Wow, excuse me. And also, I'm going to leave the Discord server link in the top, top, Jesus, in the top link of the description in the video. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and join that Discord server, and I will talk to you all later. Peace out.